Welcome back to my channel and hello if you're new here. So today I thought I would do, I was going to call it like an autumnal vlog, I don't know, autumn reset, I, I don't I didn't really know what I was going to call it but I've basically, I've got to go into Bristol like where I shop because uh, I've got to go get some shopping for tea and stuff like that so I thought I would go and get a pumpkin spice latte because I've never bought one before. I'm going to start driving actually so. I can chat and drive. So today, I was thinking of doing like an autumn vlog because Rachel Leary did a video not that long ago of her trying her first pumpkin spice latte. And I wanna go try one because I've never had one either. They're really popular, everyone says they're nice. So I wanna go try one. So that's what I'm doing today. I'm only gonna go try one because I've got to drive into town anyway. Because I've got to go get stuff for tea because I'm making like a homemade nand is what I've made before. It's really good. So me and Joe said we want to have that for tea. So I've got to go by that and I just thought I'll pop by Costa. I I'm a Costa girl. Like I if I get ice drinks or if I go get coffees, I go to Costa. So I'm not really too sure if they sell pumpkin spice lattes there. I'll have to pull over and search it up, but yes, I want to go try one of those. I want to make an autumn mood board when I get home to like put on my laptop. Um, I don't know, it's probably really pointless and you probably don't care about this, but I don't know, I've seen it on Pinterest or I've seen it on like a YouTube video or something of someone doing it and I just thought like autumn is my favourite season. I don't feel very wintry or like cosy yet. Me and Joe have only had like two film nights so far and that's just really unlike me. Like I'm very, I'm such a cosy person. I don't know, I just want to get in the mood a little bit more and I didn't have anything to do today. I've got the day off work so I thought why not try get a video filmed and get out of the house for a little bit because I wake up about 10 o'clock so I've not really done much. It's quarter to three at the minute actually. It's probably the worst time to go do this because there's going to be traffic, like school traffic. I should have just did like spend the weekend with me. It's not even the weekend, it's Friday. I haven't even mentioned that. That's, that's how much this video is a mess. I haven't said what day it is, I haven't said anything. But yeah, it's a Friday today. Um, yeah, I should have just done like spend two days with me because I vlogged yesterday as well. Um, and I doubt I'll get much footage today, so I should have just added it on with the vlog yesterday, but oh well. I think that's about everything I need to talk about right now, to be honest. So I think I might switch the camera off, save my battery, because I, I know I haven't got a lot of battery. And then I'll come back on when I've gotten nearer to a Costa. Guys, so bad news, Costa don't deal pumpkin spice lattes. So... I'm gonna have to drive to Starbucks, which is a bit of a drive away. And the traffic is, oh, the traffic. Traffic is gonna be so bad. Do you know what? No, I'm just gonna go to Costa and get a coffee. And then I'm just gonna get a pumpkin spice latte next, well, another time because it is literally school hour. Traffic is already really rubbish where I am. And where I'm going, traffic all, like where the Starbucks is, traffic is always so bad. So this video is a bit of a flop, I'm not gonna lie. But seeing as I'm here, I am gonna go get a um, drink from Costa. So yes, maybe I'll just get a new drink from Costa. Maybe that might be fun. Not really. Oh, 
Hi, welcome to Costa. How can I help? Hiya. Um, can I just have a caramel ice latte, please? Medium? Yes, please. Medium caramel ice latte. Anything else? That's it, thank you. Yep. Okay, let's go to the window. Thank okay. you. Got me usual. No. Thank you. That's lovely. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Right, I think I might just park up in Costa a sec collect my thoughts right that will do i've got the dogs with me by the way i don't think i actually mentioned that yeah i've got the dogs with me haven't i yeah 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 i felt bad leaving them because they're because me and joe go to work and stuff they are stuck in house quite a lot so well they can come on the driver put their blanket in the back and stuff I'm so annoyed that Costa didn't do pumpkin spice lattes do you know what? I was I'm sorry if I sound a bit of a twat when I say latte by the way I want to be like latte I had a feeling that they didn't do them because I thought it was just a Starbucks thing but Starbucks is like that's a good coffee now that I'm sat here to be honest I've got nothing to talk about. Just been sat on my phone and I've just seen that they are opening a Sephora in Bristol. Um Oh no, not in Bristol, sorry, in the UK. Which we can't get Sephora in the UK. Um But to be honest, when I went where did I go? Portugal. When I went to Portugal, there was a shopping mall there and they had a well it's a pretty small Sephora, I'm not gonna lie. But I don't know, like, do you know, like, when I was younger, I used to watch a lot of YouTubers. Um, and Sephora was, like, the dream, you know? Whenever anyone goes on holiday and stuff, they go to Sephora. But, yeah, it was it was a bit rubbish, I'm not going to lie. It wasn't amazing. It was just, like, um, like, I feel like a lot of the stuff in there, you can get on a lot of websites now to get delivered to the UK. So, I feel like... As much as it'll be nice to go visit the shop, it'll be quite cool, like to like live your childhood dream. A lot of the stuff in there you can just get on websites now and get it delivered to the UK. So it's like, does it make it as exciting? The only thing that you can get is like the Sephora face masks and everything, which are really good. Like I did buy quite a few of those. Sorry, I keep looking at the screen still. Like I did buy quite a few of these when I went. Like I bought like a hair mask, foot mask, face mask, hand masks. I bought quite a few of them to just try them and they were they were pretty cheap to be fair um so yeah that was a little opinion for you yeah what I might do is quickly go my phone and try finding some like I don't know opinions or questions to answer um so at least if this if I want to upload this video I've got something to talk about because I'll be just sat around silence right now yeah I guess I could it could be like a driving chat with me kind of video I'm gonna get comfy because I feel like I may be sat here a while but I find a page with unpopular opinions. So the first one, Beyonce is overrated. I think I agree with this, you know. I do think I, like, don't, I never listen to her music. I don't know. Some of her songs, like, some of her songs are good, don't get me wrong. Like, it's definitely her old stuff that is better. Yeah, I don't listen to her music that much, so to me it is a bit overrated because I don't love her as much as other people, but I guess I can see why people do love her. But I would say, I think I prefer Rihanna to Beyonce. That's probably an unpopular opinion there, but yeah, I think I do. David Attenborough, Attenborough? David Attenborough is overrated and nothing more than a glorified voiceover artist. Hell no. When David Attenborough dies, that is gonna be a shock to the nation. Like that is gonna be insane. He's amazing like the stuff that he's done and the stuff that he's achieved and the places he's visited and he's sorry that's my keys he's yeah he's amazing he's not overrated at all he's underrated if anything 
If it was underrated or over it, it would be underrated for sure. Marriage no longer works. I guess I kind of agree with that. I don't know. I don't know. I guess it's 50 50. Like, it works for some people and it doesn't work for some other people. But I do think, like, m me and my boyfriend Jay, we were talking about this and he was saying that his grandma said, like, a lot of relationships don't work now like they did in the olden days because obviously back in the olden days men used to go to work they used to earn the money women used to stay at home do the housework or like look after the children or whatever and it was like you the women were doing that the men were doing that and that was it and then like you both had your duties i guess but now like the man works women works and then when you get home someone's got to cut the tea but neither of them want to do it do that because they've both been to work um don't know if that makes sense, but like they've both been to work, so when you've got to go and look after the kids, do the housework, cook tea, neither of them want to do that because they, they've both been doing stuff all day, you know what I mean? So I think maybe that's why marriage don't work sometimes because it's tough because both sides of the party do things and work hard. So maybe that's why marriage don't work as much as it used to. Um, like you hear a lot more people getting divorced nowadays than before. Mashed potato is the most disgusting thing ever invented. Absolutely not. Mashed potato is amazing. I love mashed potato. I feel like I'm shouting. Like, I'm getting so hyped up about mashed potato. But, no. Like, Nando's mashed potato is unreal. You can't... It slaps. It honestly does slap. Pineapple on pizza. Now, I don't think pineapple on pizza is that bad. I really don't. Like, I wouldn't choose it, and I wouldn't go out and buy it, but if I was really hungry and that was the only thing to eat, like, I would eat it. There's one saying, Harry Potter is crap. So, I don't think Harry Potter is crap, but I've watched it once, and that's probably the only time I'll ever watch it. Like, I don't think I'll ever sit there and rewatch the Harry Potters, to be honest. I don't know. Would I? I don't know. They're just so long. And like with series and stuff, like series are long as well, but you can like, like episodes are shorter and you can stop at any time and restart it any anytime you want. But Harry Potter, I feel like I couldn't just watch one of them. Like I'd have to watch them in order, like one to, I don't even know, I can't remember how many there are now. Yeah, so I don't know. I don't know if, it, I would say it's crap. It is really good, but people sit there and watch that all the time and they watch like, one of them like one of the films now and again i couldn't do that right let me go on to another page because i've pretty much flipped through some of those already that money can buy happiness yeah oh i don't know mm. i don't know with that one actually because money can buy happiness like money can make you happy the things that you can buy with money makes you happy but I guess it's like a short fix like it doesn't buy you long-term happiness if you get what I mean like it'll make you happy for a short period of time and then you're stuck with the thing that you are unhappy about again so it does and it doesn't it buys you short-term happiness long-term no yeah I would say that you can have kids before you get married 100% I'll probably have kids before I get married I think I will. I reckon I'll fall pregnant before I get married. I don't, like, I'm not too fussed about getting married, to be honest. Like, that's... I don't know. Like, I feel like, with marriage, I feel like it puts a lot of pressure on your relationship. I don't know. Like, it doesn't put pressure. That's, like, the wrong word to say. But I feel like... Like, you hear a lot of things where people are really happy together and then once they get married, things go south. Like, I'm not too... If I didn't get married, I don't think I'd be too bothered. I don't know. I might feel differently when I'm a bit older. Like, I do like the, the, the act of commitment and stuff like that, but... Oh, pardon me. I feel like looking at people's marriages and stuff like that, getting married and having that commitment sometimes doesn't mean squat, because... Just because you've signed a piece of paper and you've had this big ceremony doesn't mean... Yeah. I hope you get what I mean. Like, it's like a, it's just a gesture. 
you know what I mean? It's just like um, it's an act of I, I don't know how I'm trying to explain this. I hope you get what I mean. Like, marriage is great and all. I probably will get married, but sometimes I don't see the point in it, if you get what I mean. I don't know, that's probably a really unpopular opinion. Actually saying that, it probably isn't. But like, I don't know. I'm more of a, a kid's type of person. Sorry, Joe's calling me. Hello? Hi, This is leading on from the marriage thing a little bit. Not every couple needs to have children. No, definitely not. Not every couple needs to have children. I guess it's a lifestyle choice. If your lifestyle doesn't fit with that, then... Sorry, I keep playing with my... I need to stop. I, I, I need to stop. I need to put a stop to the terror playing because it is irritating. But yeah, not every couple needs to have children. If it isn't, If it doesn't suit your lifestyle, then no, you don't. Yeah, so like career-driven people... They don't want to have children because obviously they want to focus on their career and like or like want to go traveling or whatever but i feel like that's all well and good like when you're young and stuff if that's if that's what you decide that you want to do that's that's brilliant you know you want to go out and see the world you want to focus on your career and earn loads of money and you know be driven sorry um but i feel like once you get old i feel like you are going to regret it a little bit like when you're past a certain age i feel like that's when you're kind of regret not having children it's like the way people feel i guess like i definitely want to have kids like that's one of my life go like probably my biggest life goal like is to have a child but some people just don't feel that way i guess water tastes better without ice cubes no definitely definitely not i i can't drink water i feel like i'm still shiting am i shiting i don't know i've just turned the volume down on this video so i'm shiting but no 100 percent water needs to have ice in it or it needs to have been in the fridge all night or all day 100 percent i don't like water has got to be freezing cold for me um so yeah no i disagree with that but i do but i've heard somewhere actually that drinking cold water is bad for you i think it's bad for your insides maybe or and um, it makes you pee more. I don't know how tr how true that is, but yeah, I've heard that. So maybe I need to stop drinking cold water because when like when I'm in work, I do have a uh, a water bottle which I fill up every day. Uh, I think it's a liter, and I drink that. But I, like I'm going to the toilet constantly. It is annoying. It makes you just not want to drink water. And PDA isn't that weird. It's actually sweet. Mm. PDA isn't bad to a certain extent when people are eating each other's face in front of me and stuff I don't like that I think there's a time and place for that like I'm not like if someone does it I'm not like oh my god you're disgusting like I don't get angry about it and it doesn't annoy me or anything but I do like I do look at it and I think oh you could probably be doing that at home in the bedroom you know or just at home or inside you know you don't I don't want that right in my face yeah, I but it doesn't like it doesn't make me angry, but I am just like, eh, could do it somewhere else, you know? But if it's just like a cuddle or a kiss or something, like I think that's fine because I think like affection is nat natural, you know what I mean? It's it's, it's a nice thing. It's, it shouldn't be a thing that should be weird. Um because it's it's just like love, you know. It's just I don't know. Yeah, it's just like it's just affection. So, yeah, it shouldn't be made to a bad thing, but for like yeah it gets to a certain extent my battery is gonna die my battery's flashing oh no right my battery is blah, 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 blah. what was i gonna say my battery is flashing so i'm gonna have to end this video here because my house is far away so i'm not gonna be able to charge my battery any anytime soon so i'm gonna end this video here Thank you so much for watching. I'm sorry this is a bit of a messy video and didn't really make sense and I didn't actually do what I said I was going to do in this video. But, I don't know. Just chill video. I had nothing to do today. So I hope you enjoyed the little unpopular opinion section. But I will see you in my next video. Uh, I don't know what my next video will be. I'm going to have to think of something to film. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And yeah, I will see you soon I guess. Bye! Bye-bye. Bye. Bye, guys.